What is love? According to my very wise six-year-old students, love is hugs and kisses. Love is when your brother takes your toy and you forgive him, even when you don't really want to. Love is, my, um, love is two old people at a restaurant just staring at each other. Love is my teacher. I thank God for the opportunity to be here tonight, and it is a true privilege to stand amongst some amazing teachers. However, it is even more of an honor to be in the classroom each and every day. As educators, we have the unique privilege to mold and shape not just the lives, but the hearts of our students. And no one said that was an easy task. Our days may be long and full of meetings, scrap lesson plans, many unexpected surprises, challenging friends, too many papers to grade, and sacrificing more than we ever imagined. But it is the smiles, the giggles, in my case, the dance parties, the aha moments, the tears of joy, and sweet comments like, love is my teacher, that make all the sacrificing worthwhile. Teaching certainly is not a one-man band, and I am uh, truly blessed to be surrounded with a community of support. A big thank you to my husband, my parents, and my brother for um, their unwavering dedication and their countless hours of service. You've truly made teaching a family affair. To my principal, Dr. Borgard, for um, believing in me when so many others would not. To my colleagues for mentoring me and going along with all of my crazy ideas. And finally, to my students who fill me with incredible joy and have forever changed my heart. Now, where does love come from? According to my very wise six-year-old students, love comes from God. Love comes from your heart. It's the heart whisperer. Love comes from the grocery store or maybe your belly button. <laughs> love comes from you, my teacher. Thank you very much.